Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to get the best codes for your downloader application on a Fars device. Those codes are going to allow you to watch movies, TV shows, and live sports totally for free. The whole setup is going to be super easy and will take you only a couple of minutes. Now, without any further ado, let me show you how to set it all up. First of all, you'll have to get an app called Downloader. You can actually get it totally for free from your official Amazon App Store. To do so, just go to search on your device and there in the search bar, start typing the loader. And now, as you can see, the downloader has already popped out for us at the bottom. So we click on it and that's the app which you gotta get to your device. But after you get the loader, it is not over yet. We'll still need to set it up. So in order to actually set up the loader, we have to go to settings by clicking on that button with a gear icon then scroll down and go to My Far TV. Open it. From here, you'll have to turn on the developer options on your device. But on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new Fire Stick devices, the developer options can be hidden by default. So, if that's the case, and you cannot find developer options anywhere, there is no need to worry, it's actually easy to make them appear. Just go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now you'll have to click on the middle button on your remote for seven times and do it fast. So let's do it. And now, as you can see, for me at the bottom it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. And in your case, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. So if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options, which have appeared for us right here. Open them, make sure to turn on ADB debugging, then go to install known apps. From here, just locate and loader and turn that option on. So what it does, it's going to allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those apps, which are only available in the official Amazon App Store by default. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now, finally, let's go to the list of apps on your device, which is right here. Let's open it and there is the loader, which is set up and ready to use on your device. But before actually using the loader, there's one more thing which I always recommend doing. It's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN because they're super fast, they got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use. And they're not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In a VPN app, you just connect to any server. Let's say I will connect to Morocco right now. And from the moment you connect, all your traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means no one can track you or snoop on you online. And that's really important if you want to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you want to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in a pinned comment below the video or in the description of the video, you'll get 3 months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN, with 3 months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on the screen right now, with a camera of your phone. It works the same way and it's also going to give you the same deal for Nord. And now, finally, let's use the loader safely. So go back to the list of apps on your device, open it, start up the download application. There on the left side menu, make sure to click on Home and not on Browser. That's really important. So click on Home and now we'll need to enter links and codes. So the first code is going to be 234. 089, so once again, 234089, enter it as you see, and then click on go. This code is going to lead us to an app called Streamfire, which is an amazing application to watch live TV as well as live sports online. As you can see, the download has already started. Now just click on the installation button and the app will be installed to your device. And after the app was installed, don't click on open yet, instead press on done because this way we'll have an option to delete the installation files. As we don't we need them anymore on your device, so click on delete and then delete once again. Now let's go to the list of apps near device, which is right here. We open it and there's the stream fire, which we just downloaded. 
Now I would recommend you to click on the options button on your remote. That's the button with three horizontal lines. Click on it and then press on move to front. This way stream fire is always going to be at the very top of your application list and therefore it's going to be super easy for you to access the app every time you need it. Just don't forget to keep the VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble. Then you can finally open the app. And in the app you'll get access to hundreds of channels from all over the world, including US, UK, Canada, Australia and so on. I just had to blur out my screen because of YouTube rules, but in your case, of course, it's not going to be blurry. So now you learn how to watch live TV as well as live sports online, but still we need one more application in order to allow you to watch movies as well as TV shows. So we need to head back to the downloader application, open it up, click on home, delete that code, and now we'll have to enter a link, which is going to be on stream.so. So once again, it's on stream. Dot so. There you go, there is the link, you can see it on your screen right now, so just enter at it as you see and click on go. And the on-stream application is an amazing app that you can use to watch movies as well as TV shows. And now, after that website has opened, just go down a bit, click on download on-stream and then on that green button right here. Now the download is going to start for us and that shouldn't take too long. And then you click on install and wait for the app to be installed on your Fire Stick or Android TV. Then of course we click on done and delete the installation files from the device. After that, go back to the list of applications, locate on stream, just like previously, put it up front, and now you got an amazing app to watch movies and TV shows totally for free, as well as live TV via Steam Fire. Hope you enjoyed the video and see you next time. Bye bye.